It's nothing I hear greater when it's coming to my family. I keep my girls right by my side like a fanny. Giant crawling to the zone and she so fancy. Dirty came out first, so she so unlike her daddy. I just wanna give my girls the world and make them happy. You shit out my girl, I can't wait till we get married. My bad come for anything. I run up a bad song about that wedding ring. I can never repair, she gave me my offspring. Okay guys, so I didn't finish the garlic pickle yesterday. Or garlic flavored pickle. It is nice thing. Are you serious, Keisha? What made you want to get this? Because I'm craving pickles. So I want to try all three different... I, tried, I picked up three different brands. Well, the one you gave me, and then I picked up two other different brands. Drink the juice first. No. Just sip a, j the juice. It'd be better just eat the pickle first. No, you have to sip the juice. It's already marinating in it. Oh my gosh. It's not cold. Yeah, that's how pickle's supposed to be. <laughs> what it tastes like? like it's like it don't got a taste like it got a taste but it's like it leaves so find it it's supposed to be garlicky y'all i want to show y'all my breakfast well i already had breakfast but this is my breakfast part too because i ate it so i got up with the girls yeah i don't taste the garlic you don't taste the garlic okay, well I'm, that's what i'm saying sip some of the drink and then no. bite it mm -mm. So you don't like it is what you're saying? No, I don't like it. At all? No. What's the scale of one for five? Yeah, four. That's good. I mean, oh, well, I thought you said ten. Like a, um, like a one. Wait, one? Say so you like the other pickles better that you got me? Yeah, the red ones. Someone said it's because it's kosher. What's the difference? Kosher, pickle, and... Everything red. kosher. Jaya kind of liked it. Journey didn't care too much for it, but Jaya... Yeah. I kind of liked it. Y'all, so right now I'm watching, let me pause it, because last time I was watching something on Netflix and I was like filming it. I had to edit it so y'all didn't even get to see, but I was filming it and the voice was playing. Y'all, they flagged me. I had to like re-upload again. But anyways, y'all, so I'm watching the trials of Gabriel Fernandez. Y'all, when I say my heart goes out to this child, like I almost wanted to stop watching it because I'm like, I'm so disgusted and so heartbroken from the trauma that he endured his you know his throughout his young life but i'm just you know i love stuff like this as a poli sci minor in college you know i like hearing about trials and that's like of interest to me and all the other stuff um and i just really want to hear what the people in his life have to say because i just feel like everyone failed him like everyone failed him and i know i'm seeing some people who were a part of his family who are you know very sad and as well and didn't expect it i don't know it's just to me as a mother like if i was to see another child especially in my family it's just like me seeing my niece like every time i see her she has a black eye or a bruised lip or something like that like i'm not gonna just assume like oh well I know my brother or his wife are you know sometimes aggressive but i don't think he'll get to worst case scenario like i just couldn't like myself i would probably remove my nieces out of the home like myself and then handle the authorities so i don't know like you know i wasn't there and it can only show but so much i know one of the girls who just spoke said she was a minor at the time but y'all, this is just, y'all, I would encourage everybody to go and look, um, go watch this just to see, it just makes me love my babies even more and appreciate them even more because I just, you know, they're in good hands and they would never have to endure, you know, trauma and especially being afflicted upon by their family because that was, whew, y'all, that would never happen. But anyways, y'all, on another note, let me take that off my notifications are on but um on another note y'all so look i posted this on my insta story 
It says at least 200 people traveling through Atlanta airport sh airport showed possible coronavirus symptoms. So I looked up the article online to see what was going on, what were their findings, was anybody quarantined, like what what was the big whatever. And I'm staying up with it, but I told babe, I said, look, <laughs> this is just, I don't know. I think these are just signs after signs after signs that we just don't need to be doing any traveling, period, until they get this under control. Because, I don't need to tell y'all around and get y'all back together. I gotta, okay, focus, okay. But yeah, I was like, this is just signs that we just do not need to be traveling because, for one, I'm pregnant, and for two, well, they're all equal. One, I'm pregnant, even if without me being pregnant, we have two young children in the home, and I will be damned. So, and the next trip, the Disney trip, they were supposed to be there. Oh my gosh, I would have a heart attack, literally, if anything happened like that. So, who's this calling me? But, um, yeah, I gotta go take a shower, y'all, so don't mind me. Me wearing this shirt i fell asleep editing for y'all getting this vlog up i literally fell asleep last night and yeah i fell asleep so i'm about to take a shower before i head to the hospital um i had a lunch date with someone i'm not gonna even say who it is until we actually do it um another youtuber but yes yeah, so i had a lunch well, really technically it was a dinner date uh but it was a little bit later on so i was like well i'll just do all my business stuff today um but she just um messaged me and had to reschedule i can't be mad y'all i'm always canceling the reschedule with all my friends and stuff so um i decided to go ahead and watch the gabriel fernandez trial while getting the um because someone asked me if the business was going to be launching this week the goal was for the business to launch tomorrow hopefully i can grin like you guys a little bit later on in the vlog and say everything is good to go i'm just waiting for the um, person who's doing the website to give me the green light and say she's completely done um so hopefully all that goes good i've been spending all morning long getting all the website -y stuff type of you know all that together um and you know it's a lot of stuff to go into a business and by the way that's exactly why you guys have to book one of my marketing classes because i go over all this stuff in great detail so if you have a business you're starting a business or you have a hair company you're starting starting a hair company click the link in my description box sign up for one of my marketing classes because you guys i give you all the nitty-gritty if you guys used to watch me like last year when i was doing them real heavy like people used to rave about it and i like even though the classes have all been their 30 minute classes like i'm always on the phone for like an hour because i'm doing every single thing to do to help other people with their businesses and um since then people have sent me their products from their businesses people who, who took my marketing class i, I may not say it when i'm showing people's products and stuff but they took my marketing class and they're doing great and you guys are supporting because of the marketing tips um and i always tell people who take my marketing class i will promote your stuff without you know like i'm just not that type of person I'm like oh and if you have like if you're going into business with more than one person because someone did dm and ask me she was going into business with her friend like do both of them have to pay y'all like this is not about me being mon money hungry yes obviously it's you know you have to be i have to be compensated for my time and my expertise but i'm not like oh you know like how the hairstylists who want you to come with your hair already washed blah 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 so no if you're doing a group doing more than one person it's one business it's still one fee um but yeah so um get that get all that together i've been actually doing some more research and um i have some more information some um because i don't just do the marketing class i send a follow-up email with a drawn out list of different websites links da, 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 that will help you with your business step by step so i give you you don't just walk away and have to remember or you have to write down notes you, yes you can write down notes but i do draft up an email per client so yeah you guys that's just one thing i wanted to mention in there but yeah i don't think we're gonna be doing any traveling just for the sake of our family's health and i feel like it's getting pretty serious out here like i'm just i'm always that type of person that's OCD scared about everything. So okay, guys. So I'm about to eat my lunch. Jai is pissed. <laughs> Look at her. Say what's up, mommy. Y'all get. I finally. Y'all remember those earrings I bought them for? When did I buy these earrings? For what kind of gift? One day, one year. Was it a six month gift? No. What occasion was it? Christmas. 
Oh, Christmas gift. Yo, I'm just now changing up the earrings. And I only changed it out because Journey um, earring was, okay, I'm gonna give it to you. Journey earring was missing once she woke up this morning. It was in the bed, I found it, but I was like, Let me, this is a perfect opportunity. Okay, we're gonna start off with just a little bit. Just a little bit. Get your reaction. They had peanut butter and jelly for lunch. First time having it. I'd never liked peanut butter and jelly as a child. Journey like, let me get into it. Make sure this. Jaya, don't throw it, baby. Feed it, let me do it. Let me do your first one, Journey. Okay. Mm? Mm? Kinda dropped it. Mm? Now you eat it and see if you like it. Just a piece Jeremy didn't bite off of. Y'all didn't like it, but I think I'm gonna like it. I mean, I didn't dislike it, I just didn't like it. Look at Jai, she's so sweet. If you look at my Instagram, I just, what the? Did she throw it? Mm -hmm. Be careful, mama. Jerry don't seem like she like, it. you should be tearing it up. She don't seem like she dislike it. You like it? There's a lot of salt on it. Good job, you baby? Nah, they got too much salt in that. Maybe it's a combination of the zest of the garlic. Mm. I didn't taste salt. Um, I just tasted it. I know the garlic, mm. the garlic got that kick to it. You like it, mama? You like it? Mm. Yeah, they had these PJs on last night. Mm. And they slept like angels. You like it? Mm -hmm. There, yeah, there. Yeah. She kind of like it. Journey usually be tearing, tearing stuff up. Pretty baby. Jaya, surprisingly, because she's the one who usually a picky eater. Look at her. <laughs> Girl, why you put all them in your mouth? Give it, give me one back. One at a time. She you already got one, baby. Oh, oh. <laughs> Careful with all that tongue. Act Journey, you make me nervous. You don't like it, do you? No, she don't like it. And she just eating the juice. That's how she doing. And watch. She talks. <laughs> Ma, it ain't that funny now. <laughs> How she spit it out. <laughs> it is not that funny. <laughs> laughing like that. Mm. Say, Grandma, it is not that funny. Got it like that one. That wasn't a good one, was it? You want to suck on it? Cutie. She spits it right on that, doesn't she? Mm -hmm. Got intent, babe. Y'all didn't like them fish sticks. I was kind of okay. craving fish sticks. Where you spit it? I caught it. Let's check on my pizza. I know, I've still got a while. Mm -hmm. So today, I'm going to have, where's the pickles at? Oh, let me get them some of this uh, red, some of the agony off their tongues. Say thank you, mommy. You're welcome. You know how to turn that thing around. She said that thing ain't working. Good job, big girl. Good job. So I'm gonna have these pickles today. I already know I like the other pickle. These pickles. I already know I like these. But I'm gonna try these with mine. I'm gonna try these kosher boar's head. I think I like boar's head. I think maybe. Oh, what you talking about? I think I know. Oh, that's extra. What? Oh, cucumber. Wow. Wow. Uh, 
Oh, she don't want to do it because she got she drinking. Can you can you blow them a kiss? It's fresh now. Thank you, baby. They gonna eat that um, fish with that um, soup. Yeah. Oh, you blow your kiss? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> y'all, if y'all like Target, and y'all come to this location, it's gonna make you feel like this is the worst store in the world. Literally can never find anything that I need. Let me see. Let's see if they got my type of lashes. Who's this? Is that somebody calling my phone? I'm just gonna grab these. Cause I never ever have lashes. I came to get some aloe and a razor. And of course the diaper. Dang all the copper. I walk right to the copper aisle. I'll be right back y'all. Y'all, someone told me that they had a baby bonnet. Oh, what are these? Is this it? With the little, no, that's a hair towel. Oh my gosh. They said they had, well, I told y'all this is the worst Target location. Is this one? It looks kind of small. Cantu, rainbow. What is it? This looks like it's real small, but the copyright is distracting me, so I'll be back again. Okay, guys, that treachery is over. I had to get assistance to get the um, aloe vera, but um, I got it, so. No complaints and the um, bonnets. I decided, I think that's the bonnet that she told me to get. I guess it's just doesn't say baby or toddler, but it's like really, really small. So, um, hopefully, the girls aren't asleep by the time I'm done at the hospital. But if, if so, then I just have it for next time. I'm really excited. Now, they don't like stuff on their heads, so I don't know if they're gonna keep it on there while they're sleeping, but we'll see. Because the first night they even got their hair done. I went in there in the middle of the night and Jaya had already like pulled off her um, Jaya had already pulled off her bowls and then when Journey woke up the next day she pulled off hers. Okay y'all let me make this quick. So um see this is why I don't need to be coming up here because I start getting distracted. Ooh I wonder if she got one of these. Y'all I swear by this. Now I know y'all say oh you could just look it up on YouTube or you know use your phone but I just find that having the actual machine itself is just the easiest thing like because you don't have to worry about leaving your phone in the baby's room overnight or you know leaving your computer okay let me get some diapers I see the wipes size four let's see newborn anywhere the girls are about to be running out of their diapers soon. Uh, oh, maybe I should get some. I don't know what detergent brand they're gonna go with, so let me not move too fast. Newborn, 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 newborn. Do y'all see it? Newborn, newborn. Somebody help me. Help me, Keys and Dons, help me. Okay, I don't even see. Freaking newborn, maybe they're over here. There we go. Dang, it's a big old bag. I wanna, I need to get some light. Cause I don't even got no buggy. Let's come over here. Oh, these are just wipes. Okay, back over here. Um, Swaddlers for, you don't have like the little bags. Oh, there they go. Oh gosh, y'all. The danger of it all. Let me try to get this. <laughs> y'all, is it ratchet if I don't come in there with the actual gift bag? Cause I don't know where the hell the gift bags are in this place. And I'm already late and we about to be in rush hour traffic. Kids, maybe it's just the thought that counts. <laughs> I don't want to be ratchet. Oh, maybe. Oh, I think I know where they are. I think I know where they are. If I'm right, because I'm not coming back up here. What I was about to say, y'all, I think I'm about to stop my sweet tea kick. Because I, I think the girl was right about the sweet teas making me have to go to the bathroom anymore. Because the baby ain't that big. Now, like I said, I know I was using it a lot with the girls. But I haven't been having that problem. The only thing new I'm doing is the sweet tea. Oh, yeah, y'all, look. I'm wearing jeans. Well, they're not jeans, but these are the same pants I had on in the documentary. Ooh. Because I'm like, what the heck do I wear when I'm trying to wear some shirts? Okay, let's see if I was right. See, school and office. It should be over there, right? School, office. I just really hate this. Target is just stressing me out. Got some diapers, got some wipes, got the girl stuff. I'm gonna try not to smack my gum. 
because some people be going crazy in the comment section but it's just oh there it is oh sweet baby girl perfect perfect does this fit okay guys so i'm leaving the hospital and i'm in baby alina um we're all just here but we're on the right place oh yeah maybe you can't take to my surroundings but yeah so we met um i met the baby she was so sweet and it's so crazy because one of my sisters um old classmates who was actually one of her closest friends was the nurse in the room it was so crazy because y'all know when you see someone and they come in or when you first see them and you're like they look so familiar but you don't remember their name and you're just like both staring awkwardly even though she wants to stare awkwardly at me because <laughs> she was focused on um alexa and the baby or whatever and i had text my sister and i was like sis remember that girl who you had showed me because she when i gave her she had brought her to my room I gotta use it after I leave. But yeah, when I gave birth, she had brought her to my room so I could see her. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Where the bathroom at? I'm tripping. Oh, there it goes. But yeah, so she had brought her to my room so I knew, like I'm like, she looked so familiar. So my sister texted her and she came back in. You know, it was all good. Yeah. Okay guys, I'm back. But yes, I didn't vlog. Once I um, was in there, cause it was a very intimate moment and oh yeah this heat right here used to be the best but um yeah everybody doesn't like all that attention and stuff her mom came she had cooked because they're um dang i forgot oh, i'm going the wrong way y'all walk me to my car y'all got me out here y'all not even paying attention y'all supposed to be escorting me to my dang own car and y'all not paying attention they got police officers out here so y'all don't worry but um yeah her mom they cooked some type of dish and they insisted that i eat before i left so i was like you ain't gotta tell me twice y'all know baby girl she loves to eat <sighs> y'all when i get too cold my body start like like it just is unbearable sometimes hopefully my um car didn't get too cold for me being in there, I stayed in there for about two hours. I don't even think I got a lot finished today, y'all. I can't remember. Y'all, I don't even think the website. Well, she sent me the. Oh, y'all can't see him sure. She sent. Okay, guys, so I got bad news. Unfortunately, the business will not be getting lunch tomorrow. I just got home and was able to thoroughly look over the website um, or the stuff that's going to be on the website, rather. And. There's some changes that I want to make and it's 9 30 and I'm really really tired I still got to edit this vlog I don't even know how much footage I got so it's probably gonna take only five minutes to do that but I'm going over these emails that I just got from production because like I told you guys they did add in an extra day of filming which is tomorrow and I don't even know what time we have to start but looking at the whole thing that they just the, the whole layout that they just gave me it's probably gonna be a long day I'm really really tired though um and then I still we still have to film on Sunday um to tomorrow I have a lot of marketing classes booked early in the morning so I have to wake up for that and I don't really want to like stay up all night long because I could do that and just push through and stay up and get the website figured out so we can launch it but I just don't want to do that to myself I'm pregnant so that's just obviously not smart anyways me and baby both in the IRS so I'm going to do as much as I can while editing um but everything should definitely be done by Sunday so it looks like I may put out another blog on Sunday to promote and share the exciting news and launch it and reveal it so hopefully you guys support and just stay tuned for one more day or really two more days um wait y'all see this Friday what whatever give or take one more day one and a half more days or whatever so just stay tuned you guys hopefully y'all understand um your girl can only do but so much there's only but so many hours in the day and i do so much throughout the day from the time i wake up y'all i don't really catch a break honestly um it may not seem like it as much because of what you guys see i'm like, like literally just picking up the camera when i can throughout my day but i've been really really busy like youtube is not my only job like and got lens because i know you guys know about got lens 
that's not my only job even though that's very time consuming um dealing with that um but i've been dealing with trying to start this whole new business and some other stuff <laughs> so um yeah i'm gonna handle that i'm gonna finish looking over so far everything looks great it's just some things that just i, I don't feel like it like i just feel like it's not a hundred percent and i don't want to like launch the website and it's only 90 percent making me happy and then because if i hear somebody complain then i'm gonna take it hard and personal because i'm like well keisha you know you wasn't even that satisfied anyways so i'm going to just do what i need to do as a businesswoman and um push it back for two more days in between them i'm about to text them now and see what time because last time they had me waking up at six o'clock in the morning hopefully that's not the case this time around um well it better not be the case because like i said i got some marketing classes like three or four marketing classes early in the morning so i have to deal with that so um yeah i'll probably come back a little bit later once i'm done editing this vlog probably just have to be a little shorter today i uh, also began babes footage but I'm not gonna be able to get babes footage so yeah i just gonna have to carry on without him maybe i'll just incorporate that footage in sunday as well but yeah i'm not able to get his footage added on to this video but um yeah i'll talk to y'all um probably i'm just gonna i'll probably come back at them to edit in and do, tell y'all something else the last few days i've been well ever since i went to naomi's house and she was um telling me about her prom giveaway that she's doing i had thought about i was like you know what i remember i used to do the prom giveaways like years ago and i used to like do huge prom giveaways you guys like going to